Hello, everyone. I'm Wei, and today we're going to talk about Apache Prediction IO. Apache Prediction IO is one of the top-level projects of Apache Software Foundations, and is the largest machine learning as a service open-source software project that you will be able to find online. The goal of Apache Prediction IO is to help software developers to integrate their apps with machine learning easily. It provides an API server for data collection and real-time prediction, and use Apache Spark as a scalable machine learning approach. This graph is a high-level overview of Prediction IO. You will be able to find this picture in the quick intro on the official website. Uh, here we see an app, an event server, and an engine. So at the first glance. It's very obvious that we have no idea what any of these components are about. And this video is here to help to clarify the functionality of each module. So let's say you have a fruit store that is selling fruits. But instead of selling all kinds of fruits, you only sell apples. So now, when the customer comes to your fruit store, you would like to predict whether this customer is going to buy your apple or not, right? Uh, this first thing that you will need to do is to collect data. So therefore, when the customer uh, finish their shopping in your store and go out, uh, you will need to collect an event data. So the event data will contain the person's information, in this case, age and gender. And of course, of course if the customer had bought an apple or not, right? So now uh, we send the event data to our server, which is listening to all the event project, all the event data. And we store the data into a database. After we have collect enough data in the database, we train a machine learning model, right? And use this machine learning model to predict if a customer is going to buy your Apple or not. So after this Apple model is trained, uh, you are ready for some real-time prediction. Now when the new customer walk into your store, you get the data, age and gender, then you quickly send the data to the Apple model, and this time your model will give you a prediction that, okay, this time, uh, this time we know that the customer is not going to buy any stuff. So great, uh, now we have a working architecture that will keep collect data, train machine learning models, and uh, give real-time predictions. But uh, what if we will want to scale? So uh, this is the same architecture uh, with more applications and more prediction engines. A benefit of Apache Prediction IO is that uh, it's very easy to scale. So we already have our modules, and let's say we not only have a physical fruit store anymore, we also got a website and uh, got an app. So of course they are still selling fruit. And now we still collect all of these events. We see that there is a banana here. And we still uh, collect all these events uh, into our uh, servers and store the data and we run the machine learning model but this time instead of just train the apple model uh, we have different fruits right uh, we will also train the banana model a watermelon model and a orange model so when a new customer come to our store we'll be able to ask some questions uh, based on this age and gender, what will the customer will buy? So the, for this case, in this example, one customer is gonna buy a banana and watermelon. So that's it. I uh, hope this video clarify and help you understand what Apache Prediction Nile is about. And if you have any questions, please just leave a comment and thank you and goodbye.